My butt itch. Oh. So how y'all doing? It's Trapicana. Um, we're here to play The Man in the Attic. I think. Something. It's a man. In, someone's in our attic. That's all I know. Um. Bro, my ass is like crazy. God. Um. Let's get straight into it. I be running up a fucking check, yeah. Baby girl, you don't know me. I'm about to call him a clock, he be getting lonely. What's good, Juice Gang? It's your boy Trapper Ken. We're here to play The Man in the Attic. I mean, shit, it says what it says, you know? A man in the attic. First of all, imagine a man being in your attic. What, what are you gonna do? Are you gonna shoot him? Yeah. <laughs> call the police? Nope. Or just, you know, make na make friends. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, how you doing, buddy? You know what I'm saying? Like, good to meet you. My name is... No. I'm blurring that out, though. You ain't gonna... I, you might hear it, but I, I just leaked my name. <laughs> Goofy. It's Trapicana. Let's get into it. When I was a kid, I often had the same nightmare. It was just about this man just standing in my room looking at me. I was convinced that he came from the attic. I shared a bedroom with my brother at the time, and I had this dream. I haven't spoke out loud during my sleep. According to my brother, I said things like, someone is here. There is a man here. He is here. It freaked my brother out in the middle of the night a couple times. I am an adult now, and that horrible nightmare is just a distant memory now. Nigga, you sure you ain't see a, a, a psychiatrist? Is that what they call it? I ain't gonna lie. This, these fine phone. Is it, a, it better be an iPhone, otherwise this gameplay going right to the trash. Droid ass nigga. No, I'm sure. let me chill. Shout out to all my droids. But, um, where would my phone be? I would, uh, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's been, I feel like it's been a minute since I played any of these. How do you even play? What? What? What did I click? Oh, is that not me clicking? That won't me clicking. Don't tell me I gotta go upstairs, though. Can we please turn on the light switch? Nothing. My nigga, where would your phone be? You got a nice looking house though. I do not use, need to use the bathroom. It is dark as shit down here. Okay. I don't know where the damn phone's at. I would expect it to be next to the damn bed. I'm assuming this is this. This is a big house. I ain't gonna cap with you, bro. This is a, just give me apartment vibes. Alex. Hey, brother, I just wanted to let you know that we have arrived at home safely. Thank you for the invitation. We had a great time. It was nice to catch up. I also feel like I had to apologize for Lily's behavior. But you know how kids are in their imagination. She was probably very tired as well. See you later. Take care. What you talking about? I mean, yes, kids do. I'm just getting late, but I should clean up first. All right, what are we cleaning up? But no, nah, clean up the dining table. But as I'm saying, what? You know what I'm saying? What? Fuck am I talking about? Okay. Alright. Today is today my brother came to visit and he brought his family along. His wife and their seven and their seven I thought I was gonna say seven kids. I was gonna say I was going crazy. Seven year old daughter. Her name is Lily, and technically she is my niece. It's been a while since I last seen them, so we spent about a half an hour catching up with each other, just talking. After a while, I, I noticed that Lily was really uninterested. I don't blame her after all. Adults always talking about everyday stuff. It's probably the most boring thing for a child. I'm a pretty good uncle, so I offer her to let her watch TV in the upstairs room, showing her all the cartoon channels, and let her there to watch some TV away from the born adults. She was grateful. That is awesome. What? Why, Why can't I turn? Oh, that's what I'm gonna say. Nigga, neck stuck. It is dark as a bitch. Please, God. Please, God. Nigga, that's the ASMR rain. It is dark as hell. We put it in the sink. The night went on. It seemed like everyone had a good time. Dinner was ready, so I was about to go upstairs to get Lily to eat with us. That's when all of a sudden, Lily ran downstairs screaming. She looked absolutely terrified. It took her a couple minutes before she could speak, but she finally said, there was a man upstairs staring at me from the doorway. Whoa. Confused, perhaps a bit frightened, we all went upstairs searching everything. Checked the attic as well, only to find nothing. Eventually, my brother dismissed Lily's story, claimed she was probably just getting tired, and soon after that, they left for the night. Hey, I'm getting a little scared. So I ain't gonna cap with you. Door locked, but you still. I am once again completely alone in the house, and Lily's story today sounds way too familiar. Hey, I bet it do, though. 
I bet it do though. I bet it do though. I got a doodle. -doo. What? Bro, I'm out, man. Can you kill me? Time to get some. Yep. Give me shit first. I feel like that's more important because you're not gonna go to sleep with a with a cr funky stomach, a cranky stomach. You know, y'all yeah, know. Y'all yeah, know. Hello? Go to bed. Yes, I'm going to bed. Nick, it's a three story apartment. I swear to God. I swear to God. I swear to God. According to the lady's story, this is where the man was standing, looking straight up from this door before it turns to the ad. It's like in my dreams. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Can we close this? We can't. My God. Who sleeps in. Nigga, that shit gave me the fucking chills. I swear to God. Like, I'm really. Bruh, if this game is really, really like that, I promise you. Because I'm starting to. I'm about, I'm about to cry. I'm about to cry. God, I don't remember leaving this over. I don't either. Was... My God. My God. My God. Please. Please, bro. Please. 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 Bro, I ain't gonna lie. I'm about to cry. I'm, I don't know why, but I'm about to cry. I'm about to cry. I'm about to cry. Oh, I'm about to cry! Was that a, a a wood fart? The planks had a little queef? What's going on here? Stop. Stop. What is that? Oh, no. Get the fuck out of What a kind of... Uh... Yeah! What do we search? This is stupid. Nigga, it's something. No, you don't hear that shit. Go back to bed. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. Stop. 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 Stop.
Damn, so your fear is really to like someone in your attic. Me personally, I'm not even gonna just say attic. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna say like a house. Like I'm pretty sure we all have heard stories about let's just say you get an apartment or just like a house and then someone was living in there you don't even know. Like that dead ass is scary. Come on now, I hit the mic again. I'm like a king. How many times have I KO'd this fucking mic? Hmm? I don't even know. Anyways, guys, if you guys didn't enjoy this video, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications for your boy. Bro, the 1K subscribers, come on, Juice Gang. Join the family, bro. Get a little juice, sip, sip, sip. You know what I'm saying? But I love y'all, bro. Juice Gang, we are up next. Let's go.